Oh, right. Let me just... <laughs> Excuse me. I just want a little bit of sound here for myself. Hopefully that doesn't echo to you guys. But yeah, here we are with the Boss, I <laughs> boss Irina by Cyanesk. And I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Cyanesk and Oliver Hurt there. So yeah. We have a whole bunch of keys here. Okay. Oh, okay, and we get to pick weapons. All right, all right. Um, yum, 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 yum. Yeah, definitely going to get, 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 uh, get this. And I like this weapon. And I like the trident. And I like the... Yeah, pick this up. And I'm gonna pick the Firestorm up. And I'm gonna be happy with that. <laughs> <laughs> that's all I need. I can assure you, that's all I need. Okay, first off, a Ringman fight here. Alright. This here is something I recognize from a stage I played a long time ago. Pira Kid the Wolves uh, boss arena here, I think this was from. I can't exactly recall the stage name, but yeah, I definitely recall this. I recall this boss fight here. Yeah, Ringman is pretty tough, but yeah, I'm pretty, I'm pretty used to fighting him. So yeah, <laughs> you know, Mega Man 4 is my, whoops, Mega Man 4 is my favorite, you know, NES title there of the Mega Man series. So I have, yeah, I have faced him on many times here. So I'm not, I'm no beginner to fighting him, <laughs> basically. Whoops, and yeah, I still take some sloppy hits there, but yeah. Nothing I was worried about there anyway. And look at this, we have more power-ups here. Very cool. Dude, now I'm really happy I saved some keys there. Huh. Meme. Alright, but yeah, two E-Tanks and an M-Tank. They're looking good. And night eh? Whoa, dude, that's trippy. The Nightman, I wonder... Yeah, oh god, he only takes one damage. This is gonna be a long fight. Alright, let's just... Shoot him in his feet when he jumps, and in the back, and then in the feet, and I mistimed it. And I mistimed it again. I used to be better at fighting Nightman, now I'm doing a pretty bad job here. <laughs> Dang, I wanna shoot... It's time it all the time. <laughs> I'm telling you, there you go, there. I see, I told you, you can do it, you just need to time it well. <laughs> but yeah, I'm probably going to die, uh, die dead, dead here. I'm probably going to die here. Um, I entered with half health after all, so yeah. But I, you know, I might win too. Like, don't do not count me out just yet. Like, Nightman is. Yeah, he's, oh my god, I jumped into that. Nightman is a pretty... Like, he's easy and hard at the same time. Like, it depends on how much he jumps, or, you know, how he jumps, rather. His attack is pretty slow, so... Yeah, you just gotta not be intimidated by it, basically. Very nice, and I really wish I hadn't take that, took that hit there earlier. I could have used his health here now. But yeah, in a situation like that, like, if he started running towards me there, yeah, <laughs> I would have been screwed, so I got, I got a little panicky there. Mm. Oh yeah, well, let's see if we can do a little bit better this time. Nice. Nice. Oh my god. <laughs> he sniped me. Nice. Okay, can you come up here? Thank you. There we go. Another foot shot there. Nice. Okay, yes, yeah, see, I'm, I'm learning. Uh. Maybe they shrunk his hurt box there so that it's harder to do it because I don't know it feels a little bit tighter But that could just be me too Might just be me But yeah 
I might also just suck right now, you know. That's probably more likely. Yeah, see, like that. I feel like that would have hit him before there, but I don't know. Dude, and then he stops walking, yeah. Like, the, the, the scariest thing Nightmare can do is walking towards you. <laughs> That's definitely the scariest thing. Yeah, because he stops, like, in an awkward moment, and then, you know, you just kind of land on him. Yeah, I don't know. Like, I know how to fight him decently, but, yeah, I, I don't really know him in and out. Not like I know it, you know, Ring Man there. Whoa. Huh. Nope. I'm using one. <laughs> yeah. Bob, eh? Yeah, this here is Tyler Bot, uh, I think. Yeah, this series from the Tyler Bot series there that we just played. You know, the Bob Man fight from there. Yeah, I recognize that. I don't recognize where the Nightman fight was from. But the, the weapon barrier there in the middle definitely made him harder there, so yeah, you couldn't shoot him as easily. Like, in a plane room, Nightman is pretty easy to hurt. Whoops. I should have him. Nice. And yeah, we're going to <laughs> get this as well. Very nice. You know, I'll try and not use the tanks in the middle of fights. I'll just use them, you know, outside of combat so that we... You know, basically get to... Dude, this is interesting. <laughs> if the frogs come down here. But yeah, if I just hug the wall here, I'll be fine. But yeah, it is a... It's an interesting concept, but... Yeah. Let's try and lure the frogs down here. If I stand here, now they should be able to enter. Yeah. It's an interesting concept. <laughs> With a, little bit, with a little bit of luck, though, uh, we could get some help from them, which would be very nice. Here. Hmm. Just then, really. Well. Yeah, let's use another E-Tank. e come, as they say in Jap Japanese. Yeah, I'm just gonna take a sip of coffee. Oh, Jesus. Ah! And I kind of like these little rooms here in between, like with the <laughs> big number up here, yeah. Like kind of at a start line or something in a race here, yeah. <laughs> oh crap, you know, hard man, my, my kryptonite. <laughs> Basically my kryptonite. Yeah. I'm very bad at dodging him. Well. Now is my chance to learn, I guess. As long as you get a few dodges in, like, you usually are fine against him. Even if you suck it, uh, suck at it like I do right now. Yeah, there is something I'm doing a, a bit wrong there. Like, it looks so easy, you know, when you're watching people who know how to actually do it. It looks so easy to do, but yeah, like, I can't just... I can't grasp it quite. Can't quite grasp it. Yeah, I guess you can just slide under the second knuckle there too. Yeah, but then, okay, jump there, okay. Nice, okay. Hmm, yeah. Yeah, there are probably many ways that you can dodge him, but yeah, I'm not very good at that fight. <laughs> that took me probably like five deaths there <laughs> before I freaking finally got him. But yeah, it's pretty embarrassing. And whoops. Should not have done that. Well, let's just use an M tank then. <laughs> I went on full autopilot there. Let me just have another sip here. 
Ah, but now I'm all out. Mm. Oh, crap. There are two guys in here. Well, we're definitely getting rid of Toadman first because, yeah, he's the chump here. Just gotta lure him away from Pump Man here, I guess. Yeah, this is gonna be really tricky. Ooh, very close. Fuck, I should have slipped under there. time I should have it, right? As long as Pumpman doesn't get me here now. Oh my god, did I seriously just jump into that? Dude, what are you doing, Nick? Ugh, stay closer to him. Oh my god, dude, that's so annoying. Hmm. Okay, so as long as I don't screw this up, I should win this time. Yeah. There you go. I should just wait for the high jumps there instead. It's kind of risky going for the lows. I think this is a low now. No, okay, that was a high. Okay. But yeah, I'm pretty sure he does a low and then a high and a low and a high and you know, rinse repeat there, so... Just gotta look out for it. It's a little bit easier keeping track of, of him right now than another Toadman isn't in here. Like, most, when both Toadman and Pumpman is in here at the same time, like, I just kind of... You know, focused on Toad Man and like kept Pump Man in my peripheral, and you know just just try and keep ready to slide under him there. And yeah, that is pretty much the strategy there. But yeah, nothing too bad. It was pretty damn damn hard, but yeah, nothing impossible. Let's just fill up. You know, we could just reset from checkpoint and get full up, but yeah, I'd rather rather do it like that. I feel like. Okay, Sparkman and some Electraps here. Wow, I thought for sure it would be on the Shadow Platform there. <laughs> Dang it. But yeah, this is going to be <clears throat> way easier than the last one there. And if you're unlucky here, I think you're getting into situations where you can't dodge. I guess you just have to try and find a place where you're safe to stand at all times. But that's probably easier said than done here. But yeah, yeah, look at that. <laughs> he doesn't properly go up on the shadow platform there, so it's kind of like a little bit of a optical illusion there. He kind of just <laughs> slips on through. But yeah, even so, like, Sparkman deals no damage, so... Oh, I still wasn't very worried about that. Let's just save the key. Hmm. Yeah, and I also recognize this fight. I can't recall from which stage it was, though. Oh, frick frack. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, this doesn't seem fair. <laughs> okay. 
Yeah, that might be a problem. Having both the mains and these here, like, makes it so that I can't get out. Like, once I'm stuck here, I ain't getting out. Yeah. <laughs> Look at this. Ah! Get out! Holy crap. Yeah. Yeah, no. This is not designed with Buster only in mind. Um, this is definitely a weakness kind of thing. But I'll try a little bit more. I'll try one more time, yeah. Because yeah, this isn't this isn't very fun with bust. <laughs> oh, not not that I want. I don't mean to be rude, but you know, uh, I'm just <laughs> I'm just saying how I feel. Yeah, no, 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 no. That's not gonna work. I'm gonna have to use E tanks or try and find a weakness here. This is too. I yeah, I can't fight him properly here. Okay, he's weak to this. Okay, well, I'm fine with that. Yeah, I'm just gonna shape him out. Like, see, look at this. <laughs> I think this here would have been fine even without the main, so it's just too, a bit too much. You know? <laughs> it gets to be a little bit too much. You can't move out, like, properly and dodge properly. You just kind of get sandwiched with, uh, with the boss there. Right, let's see here. The series probably we're gonna work out a lot better here with Dockrons. Yeah, I gotta be honest, they are definitely <laughs> they are definitely causing some panic for me here. Skullman is pretty tricky, you know, even when you're fighting him by himself, but with all these guys here, yeah, he's definitely, definitely on another level. And the Dokran steals, you know, four damage each too, so you definitely don't want to take too many hits from them there. Of course, they do drop health too, so, you know, they are a blessing and a curse, I guess. <laughs> Essentially. Yeah, case in point. <laughs> but yeah, I'm pretty sure I would have been fine this run. With or without their health drops. I'm been playing pretty well this time around here. Whoops, and yeah, look at this, I'm getting so much health. <laughs> okay, but that's him. Ten. Dude, how many bosses are there? Yeah, I think I'll only be doing one boss rush today. That would probably be enough. <laughs> hmm. Oh my god. Yeah, screw this. <laughs> oh, yeah. This is gonna be hell to do, Buster, only. Yeah, it's gonna take so long for him to come down. You know, I guess... I guess we could try once, but... Like... Yeah. You basically need to shoot for him to fall or jump around here, you know. Well, actually you only need to pass by him, but you know, if you shoot, just he starts jumping more and he can fall down. So yeah, that will speed it up, but getting him down here is not gonna be easy. And he only takes one damage, okay. Well, you know what, as long as you get a little bit lucky here, you know, you can get in some damage. But if he does, yeah, if he does that, yeah, <laughs> this is gonna happen. <laughs> yeah, but at the same time, his attack does get interrupted when he lands, you know, too early there. <laughs> That's pretty funny, actually. Yeah, see there? He stops attacking when he lands. Yeah, 
but this here is kind of what I was worried about. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's gonna take a long time to defeat him this way. Yeah, and this video is already up to... Yeah. <laughs> 25 minutes here. Yeah, you know, let's not Let's not dilly daddy too much here uh, Some more stages I wanna get to and I don't know how long stages uh, or along this stage is um, so I'm just gonna speed that up a little bit, but yeah, you can definitely do that buster only but yeah This video is <laughs> getting very long Very very long. Let's see here. Boss 11 Oh, this guy. I recall this guy. This is from a stage I played very recently. Hmm. I don't recall the name though. <clears throat> but yeah, as soon as you get out on the fence here in the open air, or in, you know, in the open... Oh! As soon as you get out on the fence in the open, <clears throat> you're just screwed. Um, like, he will start pulling you in. Something to keep in mind. Wow, I cannot jump there. I was suspended in midair. Okay, yeah, I took a few hits, but <clears throat> nothing too bad. It had a very nice uh, visual aesthetic to it, bedroom, I have to say. It looked quite clean there. Whoa. Hmm. <laughs> this here is pre a pretty interesting combo, I think. Oh my god. Hmm. Yeah, that's not gonna work. I see why they give you so many E tanks, like. There are some very hard bosses in here. Ah. <laughs> oh, I don't know about this. <laughs> um, I don't know if I can do this. This is... Yeah, this feels... Yeah, too hard. I don't really feel like dealing with this buster only. I'm going to do it with the weakness, if I have it. If not, I'm gonna have to... Just spam E tanks, I guess. Bomb? Or bomb? I mean fire. Oh. Yeah, not that here. Well, yeah. Okay. Let's see here. Let us just use. Uh, Kinda I'm failing the light trident here, you know, since it pierces. I just gonna spam it. It is cool having, you know, many <clears throat> bosses in the same room, but Yeah. I feel like some of these boss rooms, like some have been really cool, but some of them have been a little bit much. This feels like <laughs> one of them. <laughs> yeah, it's just like it's too much going on and you see you yeah. I don't yeah, I don't really see how I would do this without using an E tank <laughs> or the weakness. This is very hard. There probably is a way, but yeah. I'm not feeling confident at all I can do it. It's just too much, too much going on in here. Yeah. Yeah, it's another one. It's just how it goes here. And now we can do the rest here. The regular way. Yeah, just regular old magnet man is no problem. It's very easy as a matter of fact. Oh yeah, it's what has one of my favorite weapons from Mega Man 3. I really love the magnet missile. Such a 
cool weapon, you know. I like it actually more than the die missiles from Mega Man 4. It just has a very nice, you know. Oh, that's it. <laughs> the end. TB. Oh, T TBC. To be continued. But yeah, some of the bosses, you know, had some nice alterations there to it. Like the one I probably liked the most was the Toadman and Pumpman fight. That that was the only like dual boss fight that I felt didn't was or that wasn't cluttered. Like, sure, it was. It, there was a lot of things going on in there, but at the same time, like if you positioned yourself correctly and you know you slid under them, uh, it actually was kind of fun. Figured that one out. Um, and yeah, the dual Mate Man and Crash Man, I, uh, I was a little bit iffy on that. Uh, <laughs> that was probably my least favorite um, one, but yeah, overall, you know, a decent bosser in a pack here. I hope that we see some more, you know, decent fights there in the second one there, so yeah. I just leave it at that. Thank you guys for watching, and have a nice day.